Hi, welcome to Biomedical Engineers TV. In this video, we will look into medical pendants. Let's look into the history of medical pendants. In 1958, the world's first modern scale intensive care unit, the ICU, was established in the United States, an important step in the development of modern medical technology. In 1960, the world's first medical pendant was designed by the German company Trumpf, and the medical pendant began to enter a stage of rapid development. In 1981, the prototype of the ICU pendant specially designed for the intensive care unit of the ICU appeared. In 1982, the first electric pendant was produced. In 1988, the pendant was further developed, and the first set of dry and wet separation pendant in the intensive care unit was produced. In 2000, the Hospital Clean Operating Room Construction Standards, and in 2002, promulgated the Hospital Clean Operating Department Building Technical Specifications. In 2006, the Chinese Medical Association formulated the China Intensive Care Unit, or ICU, Construction and Management Guidelines. Up to now, medical pendant has been developed country for more than 10 years, and technology and safety are all striving to break through itself. So, what is medical pendant? The medical pendant is an indispensable gas supply medical device in the modern operating room of the hospital. It is mainly used for the terminal transfer of oxygen, suction, compressed air, nitrogen, and other medical gases in the operating room. The medical pendant is mainly controlled by the motor to lift the platform, which is safe and reliable. Balance designed to ensure the level of equipment platform and ensures the safety of the medical pendant, motor drive to ensure the rapid and efficient operation of the pendant, the surface of the composite material can be cleaned with standard disinfectant, which can eliminate pollution completely. The medical pendant can be rotated to increase the work coverage of the equipment and improve the efficiency of the equipment. Adjustment and use are more at ease and convenient. The pendant head and the carrying platform can only hover over the circumference of the cantilever radius, so the single cantilever is selected as an operating room with a small area. Rotation angle less than or equal to 340 degrees, gas pipelines, cable lines, and network communication lines all pass through here. The medical pendant can be rotated to install the medical gas outlet and gas pressure gauge and instrument outlet. Let's understand ICU pendants. The first is the suspended column-based medical pendant. In the design process of ICU wards, in order to solve the messy placement of various gas pipelines and power supplies, and the need to place patient monitors, defibrillators, infusion pumps, syringe pumps, and ventilators, most of them adopt centralized gas and power supply designs. The second pendant is the double arm pendant. Double arm pendant systems are installed in the ICU wards of many hospitals. However, the double arm medical pendant currently has strict requirements on the lateral space. If there's not enough space between the two arms, these two arms will interfere with each other, affecting the work efficiency of the medical staff. The horizontal span requirements of the space required by the rotating arm medical pendant are much larger than that of the multifunctional medical column system and the bridge type pendant. The third pendant type is the bridge type pendant. The bridge type pendant can realize dry and wet separation arrangement and the left and right instrument hangers and rotating infusion arm can move sideways and rotate, thus greatly improving the freedom of medical staff work. Therefore, whether in domestic or foreign ICU wards, the application range of the bridge type pendant is very wide, but the distance between the reasonable installation position of the bridge type pendant and its adjacent equipment is a key issue that needs to be carefully considered by the person in charge of the hospital. Now let's look into operation theater pendants. First are surgical pendants. A surgical pendant is a medical accessory that is fixed to a ceiling or wall and is used in supplying medical gases, electricity, illumination, and every other connection or service that is needed in a surgical room or operating theater. It can be rotated to make certain tools or gases easily accessible by a surgeon whenever they're needed. This ensures that the floor of the surgical room is not littered with cables and other necessary tools which may hinder free movement or cause accidents. An operating theater surgical pendant can also be called the operating pendant, operating room pendant, medical pendant, or pendant system. The second is the double arm electric surgical pendant. This type of surgical pendant is the most common and popular type in hospitals and surgeries. It has two arms which can be fitted with a light. Each arm also has other tools that might be needed during an operation. It can rotate so that surgeons have easy access to all the tools they need without having to move from their position at the operating table. The third type of pendant is the single-arm electric hospital pendant. 
This type of pendant has only one beam and can be rotated so that it always faces whatever tools are required by the surgeon at all times during an operation. Naturally, they cannot be fitted with as much equipment as a double-arm hospital pendant. The fourth type is a surgical rotary pendant. A surgical rotary pendant is a type of pendant that has a rotating arm. This type of pendant is not as common as the double-arm or single-arm electric hospital pendants. This type of pendant is mostly used in smaller surgeries because it does not have as much equipment as the other two types. It is usually also non-motorized and does not take up as much space. The fifth type of pendant is the single-arm electric anesthesia pendant. The single-arm electric anesthesia pendant is a type of surgical pendant that is used mainly for providing anesthesia machine mounts which helps to mount pendant mount anesthesia machines. It has one arm and does not have as much equipment as the double-arm electric hospital pendant. It is also perfect for small surgeries because it does not take up as much space as the other types of surgical pendants. This was the simplified video on hospital pendants, as the pendants consist of many components which we will look into in another video. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. I will see you guys in the next video.